All right, all right. Welcome back to Eyes Open Media. Prophet John here. And uh, a couple days ago, I was told something, and I'm not going to tell you who said it to me, but it, it was a uh, one of my prophetic friends um, told me this two days ago. And uh, so what I was told was that the coronavirus was just a test drill. That was it. It's just a drill. It's not the real epidemic virus plague that is coming. It's just a drill. And I was like, whoa. So this isn't going to, this, so the coronavirus isn't going to be as big as I think it was, it could be, right? And they were, they said it's just a drill. So the numbers keep going up, right? So I don't know what they're going to do with the coronavirus. I don't know if they're going to continue to let it to spread, um, but then bring out something else. But they told me that once the coronavirus is over, a new one, a new virus would emerge from the scenes and it will be 10 times more dangerous than the coronavirus. This was just a drill to see how people will react and all, how how government how you know the governments will react and things like that. What they will do to quarantine and the shutdown and how people will react. Um, that's what I was told. Now, of course, people can you can say, oh well, that's not gonna that's not true. The coronavirus will is actually going to be the real deal, and it, it's gonna spread around the world and will be a plague. Uh, and it could be, okay, it could be, you know, that's what I was thinking of as well. I thought it was going to continue to spread and spread and spread and, and, uh, people are not going to take it serious. You know, this is going to continue to spread, but they do have, um, they have, they do now have, um, what do you call it? Uh, you know, things to, to make this thing go away. You see the recovery is, is up, you know, now the death toll has actually jumped up quite a bit here. 638 this morning. So that, that's a big jump. I mean, I thought it was like at, like maybe like five, did it just hit 500 yesterday? I mean, that's a big jump. I thought it was like, like, like at 504 or like 490. I gotta watch the last video I did from yesterday because this number jumped up a, a lot here that's almost like a that's almost a hundred i think it's like a hundred death jump or something like that but anyways we're at 638 now so i maybe i wasn't paying attention to the death toll maybe the death toll was like five something i didn't even remember but last i remember it was like maybe like 515 or something like that or like 490 480 500 504 now it's at 638. So that's a big jump, but the recovery is also a big jump, 1764. And that's because they they have um they've created some some things that can kill this virus. Um, you know, at least within the first like 20 and within 48 hours, uh, people can the virus can be killed, and it might still be lingering in you for about a week or two, but then your immune system will attack the rest, and you should be good to go and recovered. So because of that. That's how I know that this won't be that big of a deal now, right? At least that's what I'm being told. They, they, you know, they, they found the antidotes to to cure this thing um, within two weeks. So for it to be some type of worldwide plague and things like that, when they already have the cures for this thing, um, and there were, people are recovering now. Uh, I know there's still deaths, but people are recovering uh, for those who are actually taking the antidotes. Um, and the uh, the shots or whatever that that cure uh, the virus uh, within two weeks, uh, people are re starting to recover in big numbers. Um, so, but anyways, uh, that's what I was told. We have uh, thirty one thousand now, five hundred and twenty three. So that means by the end of the day, if the numbers continue, we we might be around thirty four thousand. You know, thirty three to thirty five thousand. Um, by the, and, and by the end of the month, if the numbers continue, right? Because we don't know how long the coronavirus is going to go. I was told till March, but who knows? You know, I, I don't know. It, it could, 
you know, they could come out on the on the weekend and say we have a cure for the coronavirus, and then every and then all the numbers go down and go away because everybody's now cured, right? At any point they could say that because I was told the other night it's a drill. So usually when they have when it's something's a drill, then they make it last for a, a little couple of weeks, and then they say we got a cure for it. Everybody's gonna be fine. Go go about your business, right? So they won't let this thing climax. So we'll see if they let it climax or they let it go away. And they say we we actually have a cure that's gonna that will kill that will heal people within 24 hours. The coronavirus is now done. We're going to uh, every markets are now open again. Everything is good to go. If you have the coronavirus, come in. You'll get the shot. You'll be fine within 24 hours. Right. So. If this is a drill, I expect something like that. We're getting, they're getting close because they got something that, 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 that like literally cures the disease within two weeks, right? Um, so now we need it, now they got to speed it up and make it stronger so that it cures the disease within 20, 48, 24, 48 hours. And that could be coming, okay? So if this is a test and we expect something like that to happen and they test and then we, then they are, they plan on launching a different one, okay, which is even more vicious and and, uh, and just absolutely crazy is what I was told. Will this happen? We'll, we'll find out. We'll find out. I'm not, we're not going to stop talking about the coronavirus just because I was given word that, you know, this was just a test drill, okay? So we're not going to stop, you know, we, we can't do that to people that are affected by this. We're going to continue to watch the numbers. It's still growing. It's, more people are being confirmed. More deaths are coming in. We already know these numbers are suppressed. So the real numbers are ridiculous, right? So we already know that. And you times that by 10, that's 6,000 people that are dead. You know what I mean? 6,000 people dead, maybe 10,000 people recovered, um, 310,000 people infected. Uh, that that's a big that that's big that that's a, you know that's a big drill if you look at the real numbers if you times it by ten, right? So we're not going to stop you know looking at this um, just because I was told that um, this is a test drill this is a drill it's a fire drill test drill just to see you know how the world will react how the people will react they always give a drill before they give the real run so. We'll see how we'll see how long they they carry this. Are they going to stop this in March and say we have a cure? Everything's good to go now. Just come on in and uh, you'll be cured within 24 hours. We we have a cure now, right? So if that's the case, then we expect to see this thing over in March, okay? And then and sometime February and March they find a cure a cure that cures this thing within 24 hours, and then. The new virus, they said that they're going to put out, I was told a new virus will be out immediately after the coronavirus ends. And that virus will be 10 times worse. 10 times worse. So, interesting. Interesting that they're suppressing the numbers by 10, and this new virus is going to be 10 times worse. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I, I'm you know I'm gonna be preparing myself. I'm gonna go out and grab some stuff. Um, you know I'm gonna go out and grab some, um, you know grab some more Lysol, uh, some hand sanitizers, uh, some gloves, some mask, and uh, some eye protection. I might have to order that. So I'm gonna just I'm gonna just have everything that I need. And uh, and prepare for the worst, you know, and prepare for the best and the worst and just live my life. Right. I'm just going to live my life. I'm not in fear. I'm not going to fear any of this stuff. I'm just going to live my life and pre but make sure I'm prepared as well. So I don't have my stuff. I'm going to prepare. I don't need to go overboard with it. You know, just prepare and then also live my life as well. And uh, whatever happens, happens. We will continue to, um, you know, bring you guys updates on the coronavirus. And uh, until they did, they uh, you know say it's over, right? And it's, it stopped spreading, and now everybody's recovering because they have the uh, the cure is out, and they are now everybody's now being cured. So that would be awesome news. But then we also re then we have to remember that's on that that was the, by design, and so now we have a new virus that is coming that's going to hit the scenes, 
you know, right after it. So we got to be careful about that as well, you know. You know, so anyways, that's what's going on, and um, that's the news that I received. Um, doesn't mean that it's true, but that's the news that I received. It could be true. It could be, it might not be true, okay? Um, but we'll, we're all going to find out together, won't we? <laughs> okay? And uh, we must just be prepared. You know, the, basically, the video is prepared, just in case that it is. Prepare if the coronavirus continues to spread, right? And prepare if the coronavirus is cured and a new a new virus comes out right and so that's what we need to watch out for so all right so i think we covered everything in this video and um for you uh well actually i'm not gonna talk about iraq in this video um i was gonna say something but i'm not gonna talk about it so um i'll just leave it alone there and i'll talk to you guys in the next video peace out god bless bye